Yo, what's going on everybody? In today's video, I'm going to be bringing to you the new 93 overall Future Stars uh, Team Affinity card for the Mets, Ronnie Mauricio. Um, he is a shortstop primary, and uh, that's where we're going to be using him. And this card looks really, really good, and probably something I'm going to keep, keep in my lineup, but we're going to see in this debut and see what he does. But we'll look at his stuff and see why I will be keeping him in my lineup. Um, so like I said, primary shortstop, he can play third base as well. Doesn't have a second base secondary, which is weird. And I kind of wish he did, but it is what it is. Uh, he's got 95 contact versus right, 89 versus left, so very balanced. 96 power versus right, and 82 versus left. So pretty good power, or really good power versus right, and pretty good power. He's got over that 80 bo uh, power threshold, so really good. Vision's at 80, and then he's got 88 fielding, so high goal defense to start off with. 95 arm and 94 reaction, just absolute cannon and good reaction at short. He also has 62 speed. Um, but remember, we can parallel this card, so he end up with 100 contact versus right, 101 power versus right. Uh, 94 versus left and 87 power. I mean, this is just a very, very good card all around. Uh, ends up with diamond defense. Once you get to parallel two, he's going to have 99 arm strength, 99 reaction, and a 67 speed. Just a great shortstop. And the best part about this card is this man is a switch hitter. Uh, he won't be at a uh, platoon disadvantage because he can hit, he, you know, He's going to have the advantage every time. He's going to hit from the left side when it's a righty, from the right side when it's, a, when it's a lefty. And he has good attributes all the way around, so he doesn't. it's not like he's uh, heavy on one side and, and bad on the other. He's just, you know, a very good card uh, overall. And uh, just, I think this is one of the best cards, if not the best position player. But anyways, we're not going to talk about that. We're just talking about Ronnie Mauricio and how he's a card I'll be using. He's going to be in my leadoff spot for the debut video. And uh, it's probably not going to be where he's going to be at in the lineup, but... For the purpose of the video, he will be in the leadoff spot. But anyways, enough talking. Before we get into the gameplay, let's make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Turn your notifications on. Leave a like on the video. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them in the comment section below. And I'll try to answer them as quickly as possible. Also, uh, give me a follow on Twitch. The link to my Twitch channel will be in the description below. Along with my Twitter handle will also be in the description below. So give me a follow on both platforms. I highly appreciate if you would. All right. But without further ado... Let's get into this Ronnie Mauricio gameplay, baby. All right, so our opponent for this game is going to be Griff Montana 313. He's got Tom Glavin on the bump for him, so we get to face a lefty. It is Ronnie Mauricio's weaker side, but hey, he still has good contact and good power, so he should be able to get a job done. I cannot wait to parallel this, this man, though. Once he gets into the 90s with contact versus lefties, then he's going to be really good. But let's see what he does. Let's see what he does. All right, let's see if we uh, let's see if we get something good to drive. Okay, we got to be patient. We got to be patient. Why are we swinging first pitch? Why are we swinging first pitch? We can't be swinging first pitch. That's not good. And strike three. You got me looking. Got me looking. I don't know what froze me on that, but it did. We got to be better. We have to be better. That's a good swing. It is a ball, but at the end of the day, it was a really good swing. I think it was a great swing. Just unfortunate to line out right at the uh, left fielder. So we got Mike Hampton on the bump for us, who can also hit, especially versus lefties, which is great to have. Let's see if we get him chasing on this cutter off the plate right here. And we do strike three. Beautiful pitch right there. Good pitch. All right, we try to, we're going to start him off with a change of blowing in right now. And we'll try the slider lowing in off the plate, see if we chase him on that. Uh -oh. Okay, that is going to be... I may be able to rob this, actually. I just missed it. Just enough over the wall. You know what? Tip your cap, because if you miss him, he hits him. You hang him, they bang him. Simple as that. That's what happened there. I hung it, and he banged it. Simple as that. It can't happen. <sighs> Good pitch. We'll go sinker up in. He's been late on the sinkers. If he turns on it, he does. He did turn on it. Luckily, he gets under it. So that's going to be easy routine play to... Uh, why aren't you locking in? Okay, thank you. All right, easy routine play to right field. Santander almost didn't lock in there. I have no idea why he just did that, but it is what it is. But we're going to have two outs. He's got Josh Donaldson coming up. Let's see if we get out of it with nothing allowed. Or, sorry, with one allowed. Because we already gave up a run. Hung a fucking slider to Soriano. He made us pay for it. Good pitch. Alright, try to change up blowing in. 
Strike three, let's go. Okay, we got any. We do give up one run, so we're down 1-0 going to the top of the second. Nothing terrible, but we just we gotta hit the ball. We gotta hit. That should drop. It does, and it's gonna get by the outfielder. We may be able to get a standing. We may yep, we're gonna get a triple with Big Poppy to lead off the inning. We're gonna get a triple with Big Poppy. You don't see it, especially to left field, but it gets under the left fielder's glove. Who's he got in the outfield? Just look, we always love to look at that. Look at that. He's got Otani in left. He's got speed. I don't know what his defense is. Okay, he's got speed in the outfield. That's one thing. Santander gets a pitch to drive, and that's going to be a no-doubter left field. He throws a sinker right down the middle on one to one two count, and we make him pay for it. We take a 3-1 to one lead. This man, Santander, he just can't leave my lineup. He's so good for me. He's so good for me. And Posada gets a sinker middle away. We're all over it. Great swing. Unfortunately, it does not find a gap. Just a little bit. Just not enough to the left side, to the left, right there. A little bit more to the left, and that hits a gap, and we got a double. We're, we're back in fucking business. And we're going to get a base hit on that. Not the best of swings. Actually, not a good swing at all, but luckily, we do find a hole. The only thing good about that was that we had early side of good timing. All right, here comes uh, Mike Hampton, who has very good contact versus lefties. Especially since I have my parallel three. Good slide. All right, I got to tip my cap. That slider broke a shit ton. And we're 0 for 2 right now. Not looking good at the plate with Mauricio. I was talking him up, but we're not looking good. We missed a couple pitches in that at-bat that we should have hit. And then we got burned at the end. He made a great slide, uh, great pitch on the slider on the 1-2 count after we missed those pitches that we should have hit. But nonetheless, we still got some more at-bats. So hopefully we can put up some runs against the lefty. And then he brings in a righty. So we also get to face a righty, which he's better from. So he's better facing righties. Cutter middle in. 1-2. Let's go. Strike three, we get him chasing, we get out of the inning, we do give up the base hit, but shut down any for us, now we go hit, let's go put up some runs, let's go put up some runs, we need some runs. Let's see if we get a job done with two outs. Poppy with a perfect, perfect fly ball, no doubt about it, off the foul pole, and it was a slider away, what a great swing, we take it four to one lead, beautiful swing right there, let's go. And we'll throw it again, this time up and away, one, two, try to build that confidence on the strikeout right here. Oh. Oh. Okay. He's going to get a base hit, but did he try to stretch it? He got the double with the pitcher. That's going to be a base hit. Good hit. I'm going to go to second with it, but it's not going to be a double play. Not gonna be a double play. Way too soft. Then he's got way too much speed. So he's gonna score the run. It's gonna be four to two, and uh, he's got the tying run at the plate. So we gotta make some pitches right here. That's not a bad pitch, honestly. Not a bad pitch at all. He's had a couple, of, you know, hits, especially the one with the pitcher. Those are kind of uh, head scratchers. All right. Luckily, that's not gone. So. We fly, he flies out to the warning track. He only gets one run, so it's four to two. He gets the one right back. We always like to have those shutdown innings, but he gets that one run right back. And uh, we got to get that run back and some more. We haven't been hitting well. Uh, we got to start turning it up. Got to start turning it up. Santander with another swing and a drive. Yes, sir. Santander two for two with two taters. Five to two. We get that one run right back, and we take a three-run lead again. I'm telling you, Santander is different. If there's a card that I can make a 9-9, it'd be him. Alright. We get out of inning. 1-2-3. Good inning for us. Good shutdown inning. We take a 5-2 lead going to the top of the 5th, I believe. Yep. We got Ronnie Mauricio coming up again. Has not looked good. His first two at-bats has turned that around. Ronnie! 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 Third at bat to charm, no doubt about it. Oppo tacos for Ronnie Mauricio. Let's fucking go. I'm telling you, this guy has an elite swing. I'm telling you, he has it. I know it didn't look like the first two at bats, but here we go. Here we go. I'm telling you, this man has a great swing. All right, we got to go back to focusing now. Chipper's up. Chipper with a swing and a drive. Is that going to be enough? I think it is. 
It is, no doubt about it. Let's go. We take a 7-2 lead. Back-to-back -back bombs. Let's go to start off the inning. Let's keep it rolling. Let's keep it rolling, baby. Ah, okay. All right, base hit up the middle. We kind of got a little bit to the right of it, but luckily we find a hole up the middle. Um, that was kind of a hanger. We should have crushed that, but hey, we'll take that base hit. And now we got Big Poppy. He's two for two on the day. Trouty, you got that early pop. Damn it. Santander with a... Oh my god, that was a great fucking swing. Oh my goodness. That was, that was, that was a tough one. That was a great swing, but unfortunately it doesn't do anything. That could have easily been his third bomb, but whatever. It is what it is. We take a 7-2 lead with Mr. Ronnie Mauricio leading us off with a bomb and going, you know, hitting his tank in his debut. Game's not, game's not over, but he's already off to a good debut with, with that bomb. Good swing. All right, try to backdoor him on the cutter. Yes, sir. Backdoor strike three. Let's go. Beautiful pitch right there. All right, here comes Soriano. He's one, two for two on the day. He's he's the only one that's killing me. He's absolutely killing me right now. What about a cutter even off the plate? Is he gonna chase him? Yes, he is. Strike three. Beautiful pitch right there. Let's go. Let's get out of this. Nothing allowed. Come on. Go cutter or sinker up and in two two. Good pitch right there. He's a little bit later side of good and probably a little bit under it as well. Mike Trout should get that easily. He does. We get out of the inning. Nothing allowed. We do give up the base hit, but we take a seven to two lead. Going into the top of the six, and uh, we got seven, eight, nine coming up, and he's bringing a new pitcher. That's gonna be a base hit for Posada, though. Good swing right there. Good swing. Ronnie through the hole. Come on, damn it! Not a bad swing. Not a bad swing. Got a little bit on top. Not a bad swing. He's one for four, but he has a bomb. That's what matters. He has a bomb. He's one for four on the day, but he has a bomb. I'm telling you, these shadows though, since the fucking game has gotten later, the shadows that are that I don't know what time of day he picked, but these shadows are not are not good. They're not nice. I don't know why he picks this time of day. Ronnie at short, make a play for me, Ronnie. Show that arm off. Let's go. Look at Ronnie making plays at short, baby. Come on down. Let's go. There it is. That's a ball in the gap. Good swing. Thank you. Oh boy, Trouty. Swing right there. That's going to be a double. All right, good leadoff double right there. We got Santana coming up. He's two for three on the day. Should be three for three, but he got a little troll last time. Ah, bad swing. I'm going to be able to get third on that, though. Man, we should have cried. We were all over that pitch, but just late. Just a little bit too late. Take back a little bit too much on it. Not a bad swing at all. Gotch. Oh, fuck me. I don't know if that's going to get him in. Nah, it's not going to get him in. It tells me to go, but... He had a bad throw. Yep, not going to get him in. All right, we got to get two out hits right here. Two out hits. Oh, we... Just late. I don't feel just late on these pitches, bro. I swear to God. All right. Well, we don't score. We had to run on first, run on third with fucking one out, and we didn't score. We're terrible. Whatever. We take a seven to two lead going to the bottom of the eighth. We had to score that inning, but unfortunately, like I said, it's getting it's getting a little bit hard to see the ball, man. This this uh these shadows are starting to really piss me off. I'm not gonna lie. Um. Good pitch. All right. Okay, easy easy peasy pop up to Ronnie at short. We're going to have uh, one out to start off the inning. Let's see if we get out. One, two, three. And uh, go hit. We'll get some more runs. We'll see what, We'll see how we feel. Good pitch. All right. We get, we get out of it. One, two, three again. Mike Hampton's dealing. We're going to leave him in. I mean, he can hit. And it's a lefty. He can hit. Either way, these shadows suck. So it's not like we're seeing the ball the best anyway. Hampton! Why am I why am I keeping just late? I don't feel just late. Alright, here comes Ronnie, his fifth at bat of the game, his fourth versus a lefty. Let's see if we can make it count. At least a two for five day. Come on. Ronnie! Oh, we just missed our second bomb! We just missed the pitch! We gotta hit that. We have to hit that. That's a good pitch to hit. All right, well, Ronnie, one for five. You know what? 
It is what it is. It is what it is. He had a bomb. That's what matters, right? He hit a bomb in his debut. Chipper gets a hold of that one. Is that going to be gone? It is. Chipper hits his second bomb of the game. We take an 8-2 lead. We get a little bit more cushion for uh, the bottom of the ninth, and we're definitely keeping Hampton in now, for sure. And we'll go sinker up in one more time. I don't think he may be... He may be thinking something else, honestly. Or he may not be thinking something else. He pulled it, but unfortunately, he's probably a little bit too underneath it. And that's going to be a routine play for Trout in center field. We're going to have one out. Two outs to go. We win this ball game. Ronnie gets his debut in. He gets his cracks in. You know, one for five. Not a bad debut. He hit a bomb. But, hey, it is what it is. Okay, he got a hold of that one. But, unfortunately, it's not going to be enough. Trey Turner needs to hit the weight room. That's going to be a fly out to the warning track. We have two outs, one more out, and, we're, and we win this ball game. Let's finish it off. Come on. Thank you. All right, strike three. We end the game finally after 17 foul balls. And it felt that way. It wasn't that many. But we win the ball game 8-2. to two. Ronnie Mauricio does go yard from the right side of the plate, which is his weaker side. But he, he took um, he took Tom Glavin Apo Taco, which is awesome to see that he can go Apo Taco against lefties. Just a great thing to see. Um, towards the end of the game, like I said, the shadows were starting to kill me. We didn't score after those shadows, except for one run that we turned on with Chipper against the lefty. But... We win the ball game. Santander's played the game 2-4 with two bombs, four RBI. Mike Hampton goes nine strong complete game. He does give up two earned runs, but he only gives up seven hits, nine strikeouts. And Ronnie Mauricio, again, he's going to be in my lineup. I'm telling you, he has a really nice swing. Um, I know I didn't showcase it too much. I hit that bomb, but I'm telling you, he has a really nice swing. He's going to be in my lineup for sure. But anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Turn your notifications on. Leave a like on the video. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, leave them in the comment section below. And I'll try to answer them as quickly as possible. Also, give me a follow on Twitch. The link to my Twitch channel is in the description below. Along with my Twitter handle. Will also be in the description below. So give me a follow on both platforms. I highly appreciate it if you would. Alright? I appreciate you guys watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Love y'all. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.